Hi there everyone, my name is Pritam and I welcome you all to this channel. Today in this video, we will be talking about how we can install Microsoft Windows 10 to a low-end PC. Let's say for example, you have a very old laptop or you have a desktop with very low-end specs and you are facing issues with your system that it hangs a lot or it does not perform as smooth as it should be and you are looking for windows only solution and you do not want to jump to chrome os because office is not available there or to linux or android so in this video we will see how we can install windows 10 for low end pc so without ado let's get started okay so first thing you need to do is you need to open this page i already have opened it so don't worry guys i will provide you the direct link in the description of this video so you just need to copy it and you need to paste it in your browser so just like this you can paste it and this page will open and now what you need to do is you need to click here on create windows 10 installation media now uh, what i will do i will download this tool and now i will run it now we need to perform few customization so that you know it should run smooth in low end system so let's wait for the windows 10 setup to get started and here we go now here we need to accept this license terms and one thing you need to keep in mind that please do not update or upgrade to windows 11 because as we move forward in this os chain we will see the minimum hardware requirement generally increase now uh, okay so here we need to choose this option which says create installation media now we're going to click next and here we need to uncheck this option and from here instead of having 64 bit we need to choose 32 okay now uh, let's click next now insert usb of at least 8 gigabyte to your system and now we need to click on next and here you know because i just plugged it in maybe i will click on refresh drive okay now we're going to select this drive and then i will click on next and now here we can see the process of download has begun okay so just wait for the download process to get finished and then we will start installing it in our low-end laptop a few moments later okay now here we can see we have successfully created our usb flash drive now i will click on finish And here we go in this way we have successfully created our bootable drive now what I will do I will eject the drive from my system and will put onto the system where I want to install okay now I have plugged this pen drive to the system as you can see here and now I will boot it to BIOS now I will go to BIOS setup and here I will just have a look on the settings so here I just want to confirm whether the boot mode is UEFI or not. So it is UEFI. I don't think so any other setting is needed. Okay, so let me just go back and press exit. Now here I will select my pen drive to boot and then I will hit enter. Now here we can see the Windows 10 setup and from here you can change your language if you want. But this language customization we already did while creating the setup so we may not able to change the language and then there is a time and currency format so you can choose the one that is applicable and then here you can also choose the keyboard. Now we will be clicking on next and then click on install. Now here we need to accept this terms and condition and then click next. Now click on custom and here you need to be very careful guys install the OS in the drive where you want to. For example if by any means you install it in wrong drive then this may uh, cause loss of data. So in my particular case I was not concerned about the data so maybe I will be deleting all these partisans. In your case, you may not need to. Maybe you are going to delete few. But in my case, I need to delete all. 
now after i will just simply click on next because i want to create only one drive if you want to create more drive then you can click on new and create new drive now here you can see the process of windows 10 installation has begun so it's quite straightforward maybe it will ask one time to boot Okay, so we can minimize the voice of this Cortana and we can see the setup has almost completed the installation. Now again, we will be selecting our region. And now the keyboard. Now if you want you can connect to the ethernet but let's leave it. Now here you can type a name and can click on next. If you want to have a password, you can have a password. Just accept these terms and condition. And if you don't want to, you always have an option to uncheck those. Again, uh, I just want to click not now. A few moments later. So here we can see it's almost done. And finally the last step. So it may take again a while. So just keep your system turned on as you can see here. And here you can see we have successfully installed Windows 10 32 bit to this low end PC. I hope guys you find this video helpful till then take care and bye bye.